Let's denote the given integral by i. Now substitute pi ln x equal to y. Taking the derivative of both sides, we get pi upon x times dx is equal to dy. Now when x is equal to 1, y is equal to pi times ln 1. ln 1 is equal to 0, therefore the value of y is 0 when x is equal to 1. When x is equal to e raised to the power 37, y is equal to pi times ln of e raised to the power 37. Using properties of logarithms, this is equal to pi times 37 times ln e, which is equal to 37 pi. Therefore, i is equal to the integral y going from 0 to 37 pi sine of y dy. The value of the integral is equal to minus cos y, the limits being 0 to 37 pi. This is equal to minus of in brackets cos of 37 pi minus cos of 0. Cos of 0 is equal to 1 and cos of 37 pi can be written as cos of 18 times 2 pi plus pi. Now cos of 2n pi plus theta is equal to cos theta. Therefore the value of i is equal to 1 minus cos pi. Cos pi is equal to minus 1 and therefore the value of i simplifies to 2 which is the required answer.